Click on WebLink 8 for more information. Hello, Ivan Schumann here. My guest this morning is representing the Tea Cozy. Welcome, Joe and Dolores Epps. Joe, good morning. Good morning, Welcome Ivan. How are you? you? Thank you. Now, Joe, we're going to start just with you. Uh, Joe, you're the uh, former president of the Black Chamber of Commerce, right? Yes. And you're also starting a new business venture? Yes, call it Tea Cozy. We're located at Washington Square Mall, and we serve teas from all over the world. Now, that's a transition, right, coming from <laughs> the Black Chamber of Commerce uh, as, the, as the president and uh, now as the uh, new representative with the Tea Cozy, right? Well, there is a, a bit of a transition, but it's still business. So when I was with the Indianapolis Black Chamber of Commerce, what we did was promote and try to create new businesses here. So now, instead of telling people how to do it, I'm actually doing, doing it. it just <laughs> that's challenging, right? <laughs> yes. Now, what did that, can you tell us a little bit about the Black Chamber of Commerce? Well, the Black Chamber of Commerce is still healthy and, and doing the things that it was a year ago. I uh, uh, resigned as the chairman at the December the 31st of 2000. Five. Mm -hmm. And so it's been about a year now since I've been away, but it's still going strong. It's still doing the same things that it was doing that when you and I both were at, the, at one time was uh, president of the chamber. You with the Hispanic and me with the black chamber. We're still doing those things and we're still growing and right, working right. with the general businesses in this city. Now that's basically uh, the black chamber is to develop and assist the uh, African-American businesses to, uh, and also uh, workforce development, correct? Yes. All right. Yes. Good. Good. So we, we just don't say we cater to, to black businesses because we as black business owners have to do business with other businesses. Okay. So we cater to the broader community mm -hmm. as well. So I think you would think of it from a diversity standpoint. Mm -hmm. We do business in, in that sense. Now, Dolores, I, I, uh, I was able to share a little bit. You're very excited about this uh, tea cozy I'll be right uh, there, honey. business. And uh, I, the more I get to see it, your lovely wife has a lot of uh, <laughs> uh, attributes as far as uh, what she's doing as far as the ministry, using it as a ministry also as well. Well, the tea cozy itself is a specialty tea shop, and we feature teas from around the world, both loose and packaged and a lot of the fine accessories, teapots, things like that. But uh, we also have a traveling tea room service where we cater parties to uh, organizations, individuals. And uh, one of the things that we like to do with uh, the tea party service is to teach etiquette to um, young people and uh, to just use that part of the ministry to, um, in whatever way we can, enriching the, the right. community on uh, the health benefits, just educate them about tea. Tea. Mm -hmm. Now, you shared with me that uh, before the show that it is the second largest drink in the world. Uh, tea is the number two drink in the whole world after water, except in the United States. States. It's number six. <laughs> a little coffee. <laughs> uh, yeah. I'm a coffee drinker myself. Yes. But, uh, uh, it, it, so I, I, and I did go a, did do a little research, and it seems very in, uh, extensive as far as the multiple drinks. Can you share with our audience about the different drinks that might be available? To well, them? tea itself, uh, there is the pure tea, which is uh, from the Camellia sinensis plant, and there are four different types of teas: white, green, uh, oolong, and black. And then there's the other, the un tea, which is an herbal tea, and it's just a combination of herbs and spices, flowers, fruit. Right there. So tea, uh, after blended, there's about 3,000 different varieties Spice. of tea out there. Wow. Yes. Now, uh, the, you basically have a lot of information regarding this, so we can probably go on forever yes, on could. that. West but if our audience would like more information about the tea cozy, who would they get in contact with? Well, they could contact contact me, uh, Dolores they, Epps, I think or, it's on the screen right now. Yes, the Tea Cozy at Washington Square Mall, Square. or they could go to uh, our uh, email address. We also have a website, which is uh, www.tecozy.com. T-E Cozy, T -E emphasis, Co okay, yes. on that. Okay, now, um, you're, uh, hopefully this business, now you have a location where people can come and sit down and just uh, 
relax and have drinks and, and yes. such, right? Yes. Like I said, we're located in the Washington Square Mall, and we have a window to the mall, and it's like a walk-up tea, tea bar, party. or you can have a seat and, okay. and rest a while. Well, great. We want to wish you guys the very best. Thank you for being on our show. Thank, Thank you. you. It's right. been wonderful. Jeannie, back to you. Thank you, Ivan. I can